Good morning, you guys. It is Vlogmas Day 33, the day after Christmas, and we're ready to get this party started. Come on, let's go. So it's another exciting day around here. We are fixing to get ready to head to my parents because my brother and sister and their families are going to be able to be with us today. So we're having our big Christmas celebration there. Let me show you something that baby girls put together. Look at the super adorable little wreaths baby girl made. Let's see the back. Is there anything on the back? Yeah, just chocolate. More chocolate. Now what is that? That's pretzels with a melted chocolate. That's it. And then just the little candy sprinkles, mm -hmm. Christmas sprinkles. That is so cute, baby. Are those just so super cute? Yes, they are. She's got a couple other desserts too that she's put together, but I'll have to show you that when we get there because come on, we're running late. We Let's go. on our way, you guys. And what's gonna be fun about this one this year, my mom and dad actually did this a couple years ago. They gave the kids their money ahead of time and had them go shop for whatever they wanted with the money that mom and dad gave them. Then the kids had to wrap it up bring them down today and my parents are going to open them to see what they got <laughs> and it actually worked out good last year sometimes the challenge though is when they give them the money then we have to kind of dance around what we've got right and it could kind of make it a little bit of a challenge that way because either we have to say oh maybe you shouldn't get that or then we have to wait and buy ours but this time it worked out pretty good because they got their money around thanksgiving and we were able to do a bunch of stuff on black friday and coordinate our gifts versus what they were buying so that's always fun and it's uh, my mom loves to do it that way because it's a surprise for her to see what they picked out so that's how that's gonna go. And now, come on, we've got that hour drive. Anxious to get there. Well, we have arrived at Mom's, and let me show you what's happening in the kitchen. When she was standing. Oh at the my my my! This is gonna be Christmas dinner. Did yes, please. Take a little peek at mom's okay. tree for you guys. It is full of nativities. I showed you last year a little bit, but. I'll show you again for all of those of you who have joined us new this year. All of her ornaments are at nativity of some sort, either just painted or individual figurines or like that one, just kind of all intertwined together. The whole tree is that way, you guys. So pretty. Did you guys notice she's finally got her new floor down? Yes, dad was able to get that done this week leading into Christmas, so it looks very nice. And the cool thing about it is, this is the very floor that we have already picked out for our home and paid for. So now that Christmas is over, we'll be able to go pick that up and get our floor down too. So that'll kind of give you an idea of what it's gonna look like. stockings right there one of my aunts made for us way back in the 70s we've had them that long and each one is customized on our own personality pretty cool memory that's my dad and my brother getting the steaks ready there's those beautiful Christmas wreaths and beautiful brownies. Okay, babe, what's this next one called? White peppermint trifle. White peppermint trifle. Oh my goodness. It's got white chocolate pudding. Uh -huh. Oh, nice. Oh, my, my, my. And there is the banana pudding. And yes, I have given myself permission to eat whatever I want today. So just a little taste of each. <laughs> A 
little taste is all it took, and it was so good. about that. That's going to come in handy this month as we finish up these soccer games. I'm sure you guys remember this little park. We've shown it to you now. This is the third Christmas in a row <laughs> we've shown you this. This is a literally like a quarter mile from my parents house. The little park up here by their house. So beautiful. So beautiful. So let me show you. Isn't that awesome? A city park that is actually not afraid to show the nativity. Merry Christmas! Can you guys see where we've ended up? I'm telling you, it is just not a family outing without a stop by the Wally World. We have finally made it home, you guys, and I'll show you. We just picked up a couple of things at Walmart. Not a lot, but of course, all their Christmas stuff is 50% off, so I'll show you the few things we did get. First of all, check out this gorgeous little hot pink fuchsia Christmas tree, and look here. It is pre-lit. Thought this will fit in perfectly in my office decor for next year. Only $5 tonight. Then we also found this little letter board for baby girl. This is the one that looks like the little felt slats in there. Super, super cute. And I believe it's got, yeah, right there, 145 pieces to it. This one also rang in at $5 tonight. And of course, we couldn't forget Gunner. They had all of their holiday rawhides on a clearance. We picked these up for just $3.66 since picked up two of these but he already has one of them with him the bubster is about ready to go on his annual pk retreat you guys will remember that from last year and he needed a little travel anti-shake case so he picked this one up at 50 percent off i believe this one rang in at seven dollars and fifty cents and it comes with all of those goodies inside Found this adorable fuchsia ribbon right here. Look at all those sparkles ringing in at just 89 cents each. Found some uh, gift wrapping bows, also 50% off. I believe these were each like $1.24. You guys know I love those adorable little emojis. And I found these super fun knee-high socks for just $1. And all the holiday sweaters are also half off. You guys know I love snowmen, so I had to pick this one up. This one rang in around six dollars and some change, which actually I think the sweater was five dollars and some change, maybe like five eighty, somewhere around in there. Nonetheless, a very very good deal. So I just went through and showed you guys this little bit of stuff from Walmart. It's about 10.30. We haven't been home long, but we got a wild hair to get back in the car and head to another Walmart, so why not? Let's go. YOLO! Well, the second Walmart yielded a few things. Bub picked up this little set right here for $2 and something. This little set right here was like $4.88, I believe. Baby girl and I found us some foundations and concealers all clearance down to just $5. I've never used this one. She has and she loves it. So I'm going to try it with my oily skin and see what happens. Then she got both of these clearance for just 50 cents each. Code word for today is clearance. Not a bad time of year to pick you up a few little things when they go on sale. Super, super cheap, right? Yes. <laughs> and on that note, I'm going to go ahead and say goodnight, you guys. It is well after midnight now. 
And I'm a little tired. I am ready to just call it a night and kick my feet up for a while. But I do want to thank you guys for joining us again today. And I want to remind you, it is a divine life. So get out there and live it with purpose. We'll see y'all tomorrow.